together. Good morning everybody. So I was up at 5.30 again this morning. My stomach's still angry at me. I don't know why. Having lots of pains in my stomach and just feeling very nauseous. I was up and down most of the night. But I have my little collection of drinks here. I got my protein drink that I'm going to try and drink and see if that will stay down and uh, stay in and uh, I got some ginger ale over here and my water with my Dasani drops in it um, pretty much right now just trying anything <laughs> um, every time I eat I get some pretty severe cramping so I am um, afraid to try and eat anything so anyway I'm gonna start watching some videos and uh, we'll see you guys when Kevin wakes up bye oh. air conditioner's on okay I'll get in now okay good morning good morning how'd you sleep I slept good I guess you didn't. <laughs> I was up and down so much, it wasn't even funny. Finally, at 5.30, I gave up. <laughs> I think it was 5.30. I went out on the couch and watched some videos, filmed Mama's morning routine now. Hello guys, so we just finished at the bank again today. Um, I had to go back and sign a form so that they could fax it over to the um, Medi-Cal offices, I guess? Yes. Medi-Cal offices. And I forgot to sign it yesterday, so I had to go back and sign it this morning. Um, and now we're going right back home. Okay, so... Val's have been having some symptoms that we don't understand quite yet. We've been kind of putting it off because we hate going to urgent care because there's, they really have no clue what they're doing there. But uh, sh we're going to go to urgent care right now. She has uh, a lot of stomach issues right now that uh, aren't normal. to an IV and they're going to give me some Zofran and some morphine and they're sending me for an ultrasound. Um, they're going to check my gallbladder. This is some different pains than what I'm used to having and um, it kind of sounds to the doctor like it might be gallbladder related. So that's where we're at so far. We'll keep you guys updated. So look who came to visit me. 
<laughs> I'm wearing my shirt. Yep. Yay. This doesn't count. You still gotta send me a picture. <laughs> you want me to take a picture? I can take a picture. Sure. <sighs> You're putting on my glass slippers? Yes. Sucking you up. Yeah. Well, open your now. mouth. Open your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> I am very, very unhappy. First off, I had to stop my periscope the first time because I got a phone call. The second time because the doctor came in, which I understand. And they send me down for my ultrasound. And my morphine is wearing off. My Zofran didn't work at all, so I'm nauseous as can be. And they tell me it's going to take an hour. And I have no Wi-Fi connection in here. So I have to sit here for an hour and not do anything on my phone. Mine's working. You're not nice. <laughs> You're mean. That's me, I'm mean. So we didn't break you. <laughs> nope. So everything seems to be okay. My pancreas is fine. My gallbladder is fine. Um, it's probably my ulcers is what they're can they uh, can you say it all? <laughs> so you already know about her pizza bin she had a couple of days ago. She also ran out of um, um, Rilosec. Rilosec, which she used to take every day. So I think the combination has really done her in, basically. So, but her uh, gallbladder and her pancreas are fine. So I just gotta put her to bed. <laughs> um, yeah. So they think it was my ulcers. Yeah. And um, so I gotta get a prescription and um, just take my medicine and rest so everybody I am out of urgent care and it was not my gallbladder did we already say all this yeah okay so we already said all this however while I was in there getting the ultrasound done I got a message from my sister that I wasn't able to look at right away and um, now that I've had a chance to look at it, she is in New York. She lives in New York. She is in the hospital. Um, they are thinking she's had a mini stroke. Um, I can't talk to her right now. She's with the doctors. Uh, <laughs> we're just, our family's a mess right now. Um, I'm fine. Kevin's fine. <laughs> I mean, my immediate family, like my blood family right now is a mess um, with me going through this, which I'm so glad it wasn't my gallbladder or my pancreas and I didn't have to have another surgery. Um, and my sister now with the fact that she's in the hospital with a possible mini stroke and everything that's going on with my dad it just feels like, you know, there's a big black cloud hanging over uh, the Stalter clan. <laughs> so, um, just please keep us all in your thoughts and you're prayers. Okay. I'm okay. I'm going to be just, okay. You're just uncomfortable most of the time. Yeah, I, I, I'm very uncomfortable, but I'll be okay. Um... I just got to, you know, be a little more careful right now of what I'm eating. Um, no more but, pizza. But with my sister and my father, uh, please, thoughts and prayers, guys. Happy birthday, Melissa, from the Oreo family. Boomer says, happy birthday. Hope you have a cat. Fabulous birthday! <laughs> yeah, and Freckles says, feed me. <laughs> Hope you have a great day, Melissa, or had a great day, and uh, we all love you. Hey, everybody. I've already told you guys all about what's going on with my sister. I did get a chance to speak with her. She has been in the hospital 
for two days. She hasn't wanted to tell anybody with everything that's going on with my dad. She hasn't wanted to worry any, any of us any more than we already are. So she has kept it a secret. Um, she should know something more tomorrow. Right now they think it has been a mini stroke and she may have to go to a specialty hospital um, in New York to have something done in her arteries around her heart um, to clean stuff up or something. I'm not exactly sure of all the details. Um, however, if you could all possibly keep her, her name is Karina, in your thoughts and prayers along with my father, I would greatly appreciate it. Thank you all very much. Hello, everybody! I didn't think it was going to end. E ah. <laughs> hey. Well, I hope you guys had a wonderful day hanging out with us. <laughs> at the hospital. <laughs> Megan was having fun. She found herself a falcon to play with. Yeah. So. We're going to insert a picture of her holding that. And uh, apparently it was a wild falcon. And it was a, a baby. It was a baby. I didn't quite learn how to fly yet. Yeah. And uh, Megan picked him up and he didn't want to leave Megan. Thank goodness she didn't bring him home. Our Dr. Doolittle daughter. <laughs> she could talk to the animals. So anyway, we're going to insert a picture of that so you guys can see. And I um, hope you guys enjoyed hanging out with us. And if you did, give this video a great big thumbs up. Go ahead and press that little red subscribe button down below and follow along with us. And share this video with your family and friends because we got you out of the house two days in a row. Wow. You know, hey, sometimes we have a, a little bit of excitement in our lives. <laughs> See you guys tomorrow. Bye.